and this morning I'm going to put my yabby nets in this dam that I've never been yabbying in in the hope that I can catch a few nice sized yabbies to cook up. Hey you! You're watching Robbie Fishing. I've got three open top lift nets, I've just got to stand them up, they're already baited. I've got red fin heads and backbones in there, red, kin, red fin off cuts, open top lift nets, a dam I've never been in before. Let's put the nets in and see how we go. Net number one can go right there. Yep, plenty deep enough. Net number two can, it just, can just go there, I reckon. I'm not going to walk too far around this dam today because it's very, very, very snaky. Net number three can go up here in this corner. So they're all quite close together up this end of the dam. Beautiful. Right, now all three nets are in. It is quite a long dam and I've got all three nets on this sedge. I might get what I need here, if not I'll spread them out a bit. It's a very snaky morning and I just saw a black snake sunning itself on a hay bale on the way over here. So <laughs> I'm just going to put them all close to the gate and see how we go. I'll come back and check them in a little while. Right, it's been about 20 minutes or so. It's time for the first check. Are there any yabbies in this dam? The impatient check. And yes! Oh yeah, there are. Look at them. Oh yes, you beauty. They're not as big as I was hoping, but there's certainly plenty full. There's one, two, three, four, five, six. There's nine yabbies in that net. It's only been in for about 20 minutes or so. Anyway, I'll grab the biggest one. I think the rest are all too small. Well, folks, I've found yabbies. I don't need a lot. This is, I'm not after a feed here. This is just a bit of an experimental cook up. But I do need a little bit of size. That one there is okay. Oh, there's a couple there that are okay. That one will do. They're not normally big enough, but they're big enough for my experiment. Two, I'll keep the two biggest ones. One, two, three. Oh, one, two, three, four. Five, got me six, seven, nine yabbies in the first net. Now there's certainly yabbies in here, just not a lot of size. Now I'll get the net back in. Check the second one. Well, I've hit the, the not very big yabby jackpot. Big, big jackpot, but not big yabbies. Oh, yes, now I've got some size. That's what I wanted. Yeah! <laughs> Good ones. Don't want that to bite me. Yeah. I'll put that one back now. I don't need them that size. I might as well keep this one. He's got no claws. So I've kept three. Get out of there, mate. Come on. Come on. I have to tip the net upside down and try and shake him out. That's what I'm after. Yes. Nice big yabby. No eggs. I've probably got enough there for me catch and cook experiment. My shoulder fell out of the net. Alright, I'll put net number two back in. Right, net number three. Please be a couple more than real big black ones. That'd be really handy if there is. Oh, look at them all. These nets have only been in 15 or 20 minutes. Look at this. Epic. Well, folks, I've got enough yabbies for me catch and cook. That didn't take long. I'll keep him. Well, that's a nice yabby. Uh, I'll throw it back. Ooh, that was close. Look at them all. I've already thrown one back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There's probably 14 or 15 yabbies in there. Right. Yep, that can go into my catch and cook bucket. That go into my catch and cook bucket. That can go into my catch and cook bucket. I think I'll put the rest back. He can go back in the dam. Not a bad yabby. I've actually kept them smaller than that because I wasn't sure what I was going to catch. These others can all go back in the dam. These nets have been in for 20 minutes or so. And I've already caught... Oh, there's another big black one in the corner here. Beauty, I'll put him in the bucket. These nets have been in for 20 minutes or so. And I've already caught... Oh, I don't know. There must have been 30 yabbies in there. And all up. Come on, mate. Out you get. 
not a monster, but he's uh, not a bad yabby. All oh, right, look at that. From the first check, the impatient check. <laughs> the semi-impatient check. Right, I'm going to put this net back in, even though I don't need any more yabbies. Now this is going to be the start to two videos. I'm going to split the video in half now. I'm going to go and film the cooking part of a catch and cook, and I'm going to leave the nets in for a longer yabbying video. Let's get and start cooking. <laughs> How exciting. I wasn't expecting to catch that many. Righto, I'm back. I've been cooking and they were absolutely beautiful and hopefully you watched the catch and cook video. Now the nets have been in here for about an hour and a half since I checked them last time. I'm hoping for an epic haul. Now I'm sorry to do this but I've got to say it, I apologise in advance for the wind noise because I reckon there's going to be some. The audio could be crap. It's very windy. Let's check them. This is normally when you don't catch many, when you have the highest expectations. I'm guessing there's going to be 20 in this net. Oh, there's a few. Not as many as I thought. But there's one great big one. I wouldn't mind taking a feed home. Look at the size of that yabby. That is massive. It's got massive big damaged claws. Massive big yabby. I wouldn't mind taking a feed home. If I can get a dozen or so that size, I'll take them home. If not, I'll put the rest back. But there was nine in her, here earlier. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do a tally all up of the three nets. Seven, seven that time. I don't know whether to leave them in a bit longer and try and get a feed or not. I think I will. I'll put them back in and give them one more round and see if I can get a dozen big ones to take home. So there's seven. I'll put some water in with this big kahuna. In anticipation that I'm going to get more. Net number two. Oh, wow, there's only like two or three in it. One, big one, two, little one. So I'm up to nine. That was a bit of an anti-climax. I'm going to put it right out far. Right, note number three. Oh, look at this one. This one's going to bloody... This one's going to get me over the line. Look at the big ones. Heaps of big ones. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. And go back. Fourteen. Fifteen. Gonna get through this one. I did too. Oh, maybe that's why there's not as many. Maybe these smaller size ones are getting through. So 16 all up. Of which I've kept, I think, six. Six, but they're big. I only need a dozen or so that size, and I'll be happy to take them home for a feed. Right, I'll give them an hour or so and come back and check them again. Yep, six in there. Six big ones. They're, they bloody big yabbies. <laughs> well now, it's been half an hour since I checked them. Can I add to my tally of six big ones? Even if I only get eight or nine that size, that'll be that'll do me today. I've just seen a brown snake, so I've seen a black and a brown today. What's, what's that mapped around? What the hell? I've got one big one. Must be a snag or something under there. There's two big ones in here. Beauty. I'm going to get a feed here. One, he had an accident, his claw fell off. Right, two, no eggs. There was a little one in there, it must have got out. I was expecting, oh, this one, there he is, there under the meat. I was expecting there to be about 50 yabbies in each net before. I thought, this is going to be, I had this vision that I'd pull the nets up and they'd just be crawling with yabbies, and it didn't happen. But I reckon what's happened, the little ones are coming in and get a feed, and then get out through the mesh. 
I might just give them one more soak. I'll put that one up there a bit further, close to that edge. So I've got eight, eight good ones. This is the one I threw out further. Threw this one way out. Let's see if that makes any difference. Or they all might all be around the edges, I think. Kind of got one yabby in it, it'll do. Thankfully it's a nice yabby. Only one, so maybe the yabbies are all in a bit closer. Put that in the bucket. Maybe don't throw it out so far. Let's go check the last one. Now this last net up here, I'm being very careful where I put my feet here at the moment. <laughs> it's a very snaky day. I've seen too. This last net's been the jackpot net today. What about now? Oh, look at them all! Oh, I said, look at them all. There's only two, but look at the size of them. They're massive. That's a lobster. Look at the size of that yabby. That's a, even that. That's not the biggest one, and even that's a big one. Come on, mate. You can get out. How'd you get? You can go back. Have a look at the size of this yabby if I can get it out. How'd you get? How'd you get? Look, okay, go, mate. There we go. It's only got one claw, but that is a huge yabby. Wow. So, what have I got? I've got nine or ten in there. I'll give him one more soak and see if I can get a couple more. Even if I don't, I've got a few to take home. Beauty. This net has been the best. It's been the uh, the main jackpot net of the day. I'll put it over there in the corner a bit more. I'll give him one last soak. I've just decided to move this third net around this side a bit and put it in close to the bank there. Right, it's been about 20 minutes since my last check. This is the final check. Can I top up my already awesome feed? Not with that net. <laughs> wow, they were on the bite this morning, but they've slowed down now. Right, net number two. This has been the best net today. Where's the rope? Right, is it still providing? Yeah, there's a couple there. Only small ones. Okay in other dams, but I'll throw that one back. I'll throw that one back. Look, this one's a bit small, but I'm going to keep it. There's plenty here, and he's on the borderline, so it's the last check. And I've thrown heaps back, so he can go in the bucket too. Right, net number three. This is the one that I moved to a different part of the dam. How did it go over this side? Oh, look at that. There is one, two, three, four, seven, of which three or four can go in the bucket. Two. This big black one here can go in the bucket. And go back in the dam. And go in the bucket. Yeah, most of these are all right, actually. Come on, mate. Let's go. Go in the bucket. That's a nice yabby. Look at that. Shadow's not great, but beautiful. I might as well put that in as well. Just because it's the last check. That's a claw. I'll put that back in the dam to breed up. You like breeding claws. <laughs> well, folks, there's certainly plenty of yabbies in there. And some good size, too. Look. That's a monster with one claw there. I think I've kept probably 12 or 15 there. I kept a few earlier for a catch and cook. What an awesome morning of yabbing I've had. I have absolutely hit the jackpot. I've kept a heap for a feed, thrown a heap back, and I've had a heap of fun. And that's a lot of heaps. So thanks heaps for watching this video. Hopefully you'll give it a thumbs up so that I can get heaps of thumbs up and heaps of shares.